All right, so we're starting off game one here on Pokemon Stadium 2 between Austin as the Ness and McManic as the Ryu. Uh, going in, Austin trying to find something in PK Thunder, but it's not going to connect. Uh, pretty standard neutral coming out of McBenedict. We'll probably see him start to just do a lot of focus spamming to get through these PK Thunders and also get through the uh, the PK Fire hits. And honestly, a pretty standard combo game from Austin too, like immediately doing 60 damage off the bat. I think, I think Austin's punish game definitely like elevates him to another level as far as ultimate. Definitely. Good back air there to recover from McBenedict, uh, avoiding the PK Thunder 2 hit. Almost getting the shield break. Should be it, yep. Any Anytime Ryu is forced to recover from his distance with that side B, it should be a free kill for almost every character, because you can just go out and hit him once and... Just... Yeah. That was weird. Austin with the quick 0 to 59. Something I was thinking about before this match started is... You know how Austin, he's really aggressive and he likes to go in? But Ryu kind of likes that, just because, you know, he's kind of tanky. He can do a lot of damage himself. But Austin is just not letting him <laughs> get in. Something I've noticed with Austin's gameplay is uh, ever since his ever since his set with MVD at Shockwave uh, a couple weeks back, he's been doing a lot more of the approaching with PK Magnet and using the wind box to try and throw his opponent off. Oh yeah, definitely. I thought it, I thought it was cute to see uh, him play against Best Nest too, <laughs> because uh, Best Nest going going into that set. Before they played each other, Best of Us definitely had like a sizable tech advantage over Austin. Right. But then Austin was like, hey, you can do that? I can do that. Yeah. Benedict got scared and panicked. Air dodged to his death. I mean, that's fair. I don't like being off stage in general. I definitely don't want to be off stage against Austin. Oh, yeah. Austin's always been kind of, kind of a savage, but in this game, like. This game, you can actually get edge guarded, and he's Austin's one of the few people like taking full advantage of that. Yeah. Now, I'm not sure, but in uh, in Smash Four, like it's not relevant anymore. But in Smash Four, did um, like if you hit someone with PK Fire in the air, PK Fire didn't fall; it just stayed there, right? Uh, in the air. So like uh, in this one, you may see it, but if he hits PK Fire and the target's in the air when it hits, the PK fire starts in the air and then drops down with the person. Yeah, I, I don't quite remember, but I just know it definitely was n not nearly as good. Right. Just punishing those uh, those neutral focuses that McBenedict has, uh, has always had a habit of doing. Oh yeah. I played some friendlies with McBenedict and he was like on point with the parries. And if he can if he can start pairing Austin's attack consist oh let's go focus at the wrong time. Anyway, but if he can start uh, pairing consistently. Yeah, if he can start pairing consistently, it's gonna give him a much better time against Austin because he's gonna be a lot scared, a lot more afraid to go in. <laughs> Stuff like that can happen too. So you know, McBenedict brought it right back, but Austin's definitely like not letting him breathe. McBenedict opting opting for the focus more so than shield and uh, air dodge. He's just getting punished for it every single time. Yeah, you know, like, oh, that was a beautiful edge guard by Austin. But you know, a, a lot of characters can't deal with focus that well, so it's easy for new players to just be in their head. They might not be thinking, okay, in this matchup, focus is good. They might be thinking, like, you know, focus lets me land easy. So yeah, I'm gonna keep doing it and. You know, Austin, he has PK fire, up air. All of his aerials. Yeah, I mean, except yeah. Uh, back air. Yeah, like fair. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. So, focus is not gonna get you too far against Austin's nest. No. And that's gonna be Another it. Missing, but yeah, Austin, pretty dominant, but it's, it's at this point, it's something we expect. Definitely. It's tough to Austin, gonna be sitting comfortably in winners' finals.